welcome back to the Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Rocket Lock. We are still in this iron ass cave thing, fighting these teddy ass bear things. All right, you know what? This is the final test. If uh, if this is super effective against Teddy Ursa, we can pretty much confirm that I have a fighting type hidden power. And I would like to know that I do, so... So... Yes! Okay. So, uh... Gengar was not immune to it because Hidden Power is a normal type... Base normal type move. He was immune to it because it's fighting. So, Cyberquack has a fighting type move and I think that rounds him out extremely well. And, and hopefully it's not like really, really low power hidden power because I think hidden power has a range of strength in this gen. It's like 40 to 60 or something. Um, okay, so that was a useless ass dead end. <gasps> oh god, the hiccups, they've returned from the grave. The hiccup grave. It's a well, wormhole. How exciting. Does bug resist bug? I don't know. For the, I don't know, it doesn't. Bug does not resist bug. Bugs can fight each other all day long and not give a single shit. Oh, you missed a tackle? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take this time to uh, recover off some damage. I feel like Cyberquack is going to be a monster and if I can just get an Eviolite, I don't even need to evolve this thing into a Porygon Z. Cause Eviolite, Porygon 2 is like freaking amazing. It's amazing. It's so amazing. Alright. Hey, alright. So, just gonna mosey on over this way. Just getting in battles, but you know what? That's good. Oh my god, a Flygon. Son of a bitch. And I had to catch an Ursa Ring. Fucking Flygon. Fucking Flygon. Does ground resist bug? No, bug resists ground. Do they resist each other? I don't think they resist each other. Oh god. Should okay, faint attack. Alright. That's not. Do I have an ice move? I did! The tits had one. That didn't do too much damage. Ground does not resist bug, right? Right? Okay. So that's fine. This thing's got faint attack. I don't I don't know if fly a flygon at this level is going to have anything too brutal to use against me. Uh, I could throw out... I could throw out my... Umbreon. Sand Tomb. Ooh! I traced his Levitate, and now he can't use ground moves. I like this. Man, look at that! I wish I could catch this! <gasps> uh, wait. No. I don't know. I was thinking maybe Ursa Rings normally appear in this cave, and they might, because I also just encountered a Teddy Ursa, but there's also been plenty of stuff I could catch before this Flygon. Oh my god! It's so cool though. Supersonic. It missed. Wow. It's just crazy. It's crazy seeing a Flygon just, just, you know, just hanging out, but I guess I'll, I guess I'll just let Flygons be Flygons, you know, and, and you know, that sort of thing. That was crazy. The things you wish you could catch. That's the struggle, folks. That's the struggle. Oh my god, an Ivysaur. What is this? What is going on today? It's a cave full of awesome wonders. I'm gonna heal. Wow, I'm faster than this thing? Ivysaur must be slow as shit. Is Venusaur the slowest of the Gen 1 starters? I think he might be. This Blastoise isn't as slow as you would think. Alright, well, let's use a signal beam. It's not gonna be super effective, but that's okay. That We can live with that. Double edge, damn. This is going to actually hurt. Or not. That's cool. Double edge is a powerful ass move. But he used growth, and that makes your special attack higher, so whatever. Wow. Could, I could catch this too, because it's um, poison type, so. So, whatever. Whatever. Guess that's fine. 
just killing all this cool stuff. It's appearing in this cool cave. Hey, dude. Oh, fine. I'll just have to. Oh, it's another Flygon. Are you serious? Well, Cyberquack's getting a lot of XP. And tracing that levitate like a, like a boss. I'm gonna run out of freaking signal beams. Recover. Get better. Heal yourself. Heal yourself, Cyberquack. Do it. You can do it. Do it for your own self. I might, I might just do it again because he's gonna be faster. Oh shit. It's not exactly what I was hoping to deal with. But whatever, man. Fuck you. You're gonna hurt. Make me, make me hurt myself. Uh, see, he's using faint attack. He's got, he's got sand tomb, which is a ground move. Um, he is a freaking ground dragon. I don't have any dragon or ice. I don't know. I feel like tree hugging can take the dark type moves, and it's not like he resists fighting. So, so sure. Let's let's give tree hugging. Let's give this fly guy on the old one-two crunch. Except I don't know crunch. I know pursuit. It's different. It's a different thing. Yeah, resist that shit. Um, fake out, of course. Wacha! Always. That's power. It's free damage. That's free. That's free damage. Not three. Free. That's damage I didn't even have to pay for. Hi oh! Just fucking pick that dragon up and throw it. Just throw it. Just up against the wall. I'm gonna use a potion because I don't know everything this thing has. At least I don't think I know. So I'm gonna use a potion on tree hugging. I don't wanna risk anything. Don't wanna risk him dying, getting becoming killed, or anything like that. It's probably just gonna use I know it's faint faint attack, sand tomb, confused not confused or supersonic. Has it used anything else besides that? I'm not sure. I'm not totally sure here. Um But he looks like he's shitting that out when he uses it on me. Oh, that was sand attack. Sand attack! <laughs> oh yeah, isn't vital throw like a like a no-miss move? It's good stuff. It's good to have. It's good to have a Pokemon that can deal with shit that tries to fuck up your accuracy. Cause that is some hacks. Wing attack, huh? Who can learn wing attack? Who can we put a random flying move on? Where, where was that? Uh, wing attack. We can take wing attack, teach wing attack to a Pokemon, yes. Wow. Oh. Interesting. Hey, fire horse, would you like a flying move? I think you might. Well, let me think about that. Flying's good against fighting. Uh, it's good against grass, but he's already got fire. It's good against bug, but he's already got fire. Hmm. What else is fighting good against? Or flying? That's it? Is that it? Grass, bug, fighting. I think that's it. Um, that's actually not that useful. Wait, fire spin's only 15 power? That is so sad. Stomp 65, accuracy 100, flinch chance. Takedown... He doesn't need agility, he's already gonna be fast as hell. Takedown's 90 power, accuracy 85. 60 power, and it's physical. I don't know. Maybe, maybe till he gets a better fighting move, because the other options were... Cyber Quack, who's a special attacker, and Scumbreon, who... Uh, you don't want to throw in against fighting and bug types anyway. So, let's just get rid of agility on this guy. So, oh, you know what? This is, this is what I've always wanted. It's a, he's now a Pegasus. He is a Pegasus. Can I, is this, am I, am I blocked off here? Ew! It's one of those. It's a whoop! You know. Swarm. Oh, I have Swarm. Which means I can... 
signal beam really hard or something. Uh, bugs and resist fighting. I mean, I guess, I guess I can just signal beam. Fine, you slash me, whatever. <laughs> Jerk. You leave the nerve of these crickets. Crickets these days. That's really, that's not even... I'm just gonna, I'll just, you know, you know get Turdball out there. Turdball can, can see some action. Good old Turdball. You're in charge, buddy. Turdball, you're in charge, man. You got this. X-Scissor, I don't give a fuck. I'm a rock monster. Huh? Why didn't he resist that? Does rock not resist bug? Fuck it. Fuck this shit. This is garbage. Well, he resists that. Did Rock resist Bug in Gen 1? I think it did. That's crazy. Man. Even to this day, I still don't know every type matchup. And it's like... They're... Ugh. I like... I'll know them for like a brief period of time. I'll be like, oh yeah, I got that shit down. And then like a month goes by and I don't play a ton of Pokemon and I just like forget them all. The hell does Recycle do? Something with your berry. Use a recycled single-use item that has been used in battle so it can be used again. Oh. No. It's dumb. Yes. Give it up. Just give up, man. I'm teaching my Pokemon to give up. Because I'm a good trainer like that. Do I have to go around? I guess I do. Because I have to go around. Really get in another... What? What? Oh. Well. Okay. I already got strength, right? That was the whole thing, wasn't it? Getting strength. Yeah. So there's really no other point to this this cave here besides nothing. So that's fun. All right, I'll switch you out. Turd balls hurt. Um. Scumbrion, Bastion. I don't know, fucking Bastion. Kill this guy. Just kill this guy, man. You got this. You're my you're my bro dog. You're my dog, bro. You can do this, bro dog. Bro dogger. Yum. Surf. Yeah, my freaking Bastion doesn't care if you if you look at me in a mean way. He doesn't care. He's just gonna ride those sick waves all over your face, bruh. Bruh. He doesn't care. You can confuse him all you want. He doesn't care. He's just gonna ride those sick... Whatever. I ain't, I ain't even mad. I ain't even mad, yo. Come on. So fucking job with this shit. Fucking wing attack. Come on, dude. Just just surf the guy. Thank you. But I still gotta switch out. <clears throat> Looks like crit. Almost. Okay. Uh. Tree hugging. You're up. Oh, I can't be switched out. Well, I just... Wow, okay. Well, that's fine. It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. Is it? Nope. Sure isn't. Who's worried? Not me. I ain't even worried. Because you know what? I got potions. All day. All day. Mean look. Failed. Because you're dumb. Surf. Air cutter. Whatever, man. With your fucking various air-based moves. I'm still going to ride those sick waves all over your dumb face, ass. All right, well, we, we did it. Yeah, turd ball, man. Earthquake. Yes. Well, I guess you don't need magnitude when you've got earthquake, am I right? One, two, and poof. Turd ball forgot magnitude, turd ball or an earthquake. It's a good day to be a turd ball, isn't it? Is there something here? What is the fucking point? Do I have like the item finder? Hey, a star piece. All right, well, whatever. If that's, I guess, I guess we're leaving. I guess we're getting out of here. Uh, and also, Cyberquack probably shouldn't be the first one in the team. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use Bastion because I do want a Blastoise. I kind of like that Pokemon. A little bit so heal up son you got this boy you're gonna be you're gonna be my my champion you're gonna whoop 
all the asses. Oh, well, actually, there's other, there were other directions I could go in this cave, so I guess I'll check those out. I mean, shh. I'm gonna be in this cave for like 50 episodes, but whatever. It's all good. Oh, there's this Riley character. I just had the urge to save, but it's the Nuzlocke, so it's not like it matters. Hi! Grunt, I'm glad to see you here. If you don't mind, let's team up. The Pokemon seem to be restless. Grunt decided to go with Riley. All right, but uh, if you you better you better watch your back, cause uh, I might uh, I might uh, have to I might have to uh, borrow your Pokemon. Haha, <laughs> I'd have to agree. People training here would be those with too much time on their hands. Thought you were gonna heal my shit. Thought you were gonna. Is this uh? Is this gonna be a double battle? A derbal, a derbal burtle? Is there gonna be a derbal burtle? All right, that's how you want it. That's how you want to play. We can do that. We can, we can derbal burtle. Every good hiker gets a boost of energy when surrounded by boulders. Whoa, coming out you! Let me blow off some steam. When you're up in the mountains, battle do for a proper greeting. <laughs> Look at us just. Just double battling like a couple of double battlers. Damon and Maurice. All right, guys. Munchlax and Drifloon. Kingler and... Wa oh, yeah. Water supremacy. Surf. Oh, that's going to hit Kingler, but he'll resist it, so it's all good. Plus, I don't give a shit. Oh, my God. It's like we... Uh, okay, baton pass. It's like we planned that out. It's like we coordinated. Why does he have a... God dang, Gengar! Ugh. That's awesome that he used Protect. I'm very happy about this. Kingler protected itself. <laughs> Bitch. And Munchlax didn't take much damage. And he is stockpiling. Well, this could certainly prove to be annoying as all fuck. It'd be really cool if we could just switch off protecting and, uh, and surfing, but... Wow, he did it again, and he pulled it off. What are you, what are you doing, Riley? Because I know you're not actually, like, you don't know what I'm doing. Well, I mean, I guess you could, because you are the AI, and the AI knows everything, so... So... Okay, yeah, you swallow your shit there, man. Whatever makes you feel better. No more stockpiles for you. Just gonna surf everyone. Payback. This is that move that doesn't do anything. Yeah, don't hit my Pokemon. Would you please just hit the other ones? Okay, you got the Gengar. Now it's dead. Now I'm just gonna hit this Munchlax with Surf and it's... Ooh, he's level 35! You know, I do have a rare candy. I do have a rare candy. Okay, that didn't do much to that Kingly. Not that I give a shit! Screech! I, mean, I guess defense harshly fell. I don't. I don't. I really don't like the sound of that defense harshly falling nonsense. All right. Well, we got a normal and a ghost. Uh, this looks like a job for none other than Tree Hugging, because he is such a boss. He's the boss of the entire world. Kingler just protecting. Really. Likes to protect. That that Drifloon needs to be pursued. Like, post haste. Am I wrong? This why why is this why is this hiker battle like the most intense, time-consuming shit? And and how is this thing helping hand, huh? So. He's, oh, so Munchlax is going to get stronger this turn, but too bad, because he got flinched this turn. Damn! Oh! Kingler knows Guillotine! <laughs> That's horrifying. Helping hand. Alright, so, once again, Munchlax is going to get helped out, but it's too bad, because Kingler sliced his shit, and hopefully I will still Vital Throw this night Reno. I can't remember how that works in double battles. Yes! Yeah. Alright. He resisted it, but it doesn't fucking matter. 
her twig, huh? Whatever. Just gonna go for the old suplex here. This thing just no helping hand. Why does it have why does it have like moves that are good in double battles? Nice. Like randomly this Knight Arena in this double battle in this randomizer has helping hand. Like what are the odds? I'm just gonna throw this little grass turtle up against the wall. Crack its little head open. Drifloon. This is the thing I'm gonna pursue. I am in the hot pursuit of Dat Balloon. Yes, kill the Turtwig, thank you. This guy, this guy's a good teammate, this Riley character. He's a good teammate, he knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. Oh shit, ominous wind. It's very ominous. Oh god. Okay, whatever. Pursuit! He didn't switch out this time, but that's probably because he's out of teammates. But it did a lot of damage, so I ain't complaining. Just finish him off, King Gloyd. You delicious crab monster. Oh, aftermath. Does that not hurt me too? Good. Because that would that would suck. Cool, we beat Damon and Maurice. Could you please heal my team there, Riley dude? Have you met Byron? Linear available? Okay. Oh, yeah, it's after every battle. Okay, so we're just gonna leave it off there, and we're gonna explore the rest of this cave next time. So, 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 bye.